this is April 2 and and uh, the bees are really working I'm gonna sit down here and see if I can get real close and hold the camera real still and look at the bees bringing in the pollen red uh, yellow different shades of yellow uh, I saw some orange a while ago and I mean they're bringing in that pollen like they're B-52 bombers. I hope you can see the, the pollen on their hind legs. D different shades of yellow. So uh, it's supposed to rain the next day or two. And after the rain, then I'm gonna go in, we'll, we'll go in there and see if the queen has moved up into the uh, top brood chamber. Right, this is April 11, and I'm going to check to see if the queen has gone up into this conventional body brood chamber. And you, you will be seeing what I see. Uh, this is the first time I've checked it, so you will see it as I check. You can see, I'm going to try to hold the camera still. You, they are really bringing in the pollen today. It's going to get in the 70s. They're bringing in orange, yellow, really pretty. I'm going to pick up this brood chamber and set it on top of this queen excluder. The reason I'm going to do that, if I take, when I take this top off, if I smoke them, I don't want to take a chance of chasing the queen back down in the trash can in case she's up here. So I'm just going to uh, gently pick it up and oh my goodness, the tape, I didn't. Uh, okay, I had to pull the tape, I forgot to pull the tape off. So here we go. I'm going to pick it up set it. Let me see what it looks like on the bottom. Okay, they, burnt, they, they built some burk home, which is kind of good. My, my, there's a bunch of bees. I, I, I'm going to have to be sure that the, the queen isn't in this bunch, because I wouldn't want to take the chance of mashing them. And uh, I don't see her. Okay, there's a lot of bees up here, so I'm thinking she's in there. Okay, I set it on top of the queen scooter. Now, I'm going to set the queen scooter back on top. Oh, it's heavy. Okay, now I set the queen scooter, the whole, all of it, back on top of the trash can. I took the top off. Now, I'm just going to give them a little bit of smoke, not a whole lot, just, just kind of let it drift over the frames. I'm going to take the inner cover off. Now, I'm going to look on this inner cover and be sure the queen's not on there. And there's a lot of, there's a lot of bees up in, up in this brood chamber. So I have, I have got to believe and she's up here. I'm gonna let the smoke just drift across the top of them. Oh, this this is a nice bunch of bees here. Now, I'm gonna take the far frame out first, and and uh, man, I can smell the aroma. Uh, now, it's unlikely that she'd be on this outside frame. And it's unlikely there would be eggs in this outside frame. Now I'm looking for eggs. That's what that's what I'm looking for. When I, when I see eggs, I know she's in here. And I'm gonna set that outside frame right there. Now, uh, when I pull a frame out, if the queen is on this side of the frame, she she most she likely can run around to this to my side of this frame to get away from the from the sunlight. So that's the side I'm going to look at first. All right. I hope they're not using this brood chamber as a honey super. Uh, I don't see. Uh, I don't see any eggs in that one. Ooh, I'm going to get excited if I see some eggs in here. Uh, the sun really should be behind me. It's not. I, I wish it. Oh, looky, looky, looky. Oh, see eggs. She's up here. She is up here. 
Now, I'm going to see. She moved up here uh, uh, pretty quick because the larvae has got some age on it. So she is up here. Ooh, that's good news. My, my. Thank you. Looky here. Here's cat brood. And I'm going to... I was, I was hoping I could... Uh, I don't want to make it too long of a film, but I was hoping I could see the, uh, the queen. Can, can you see this dark brown right here? This is cat brood. This is one nice, healthy hive. So that goes to show you that uh, uh, this bunch here, they haven't had, they're all natural. They haven't had, ooh, that, oh, she's a good queen. Look at that, that solid brood in the, in the center. Isn't that wonderful? Isn't that wonderful? My, my, my. Um, now, of course, I was hoping I could find, see her, so I could, I could show, uh, show the queen to you. Uh, there's a remote possibility. If I see eggs, then. I'm just real confident she's up here. Uh, it's, it's possible for her to, I'm gonna turn this around where the sun is, I'm gonna just kind of blow them on them gently. I see some young larvae. Okay, I see eggs. All right. I, I, I may not, uh, I may not spot her. Usually when I'm looking for a queen, I go through. <laughs> mm. One just got me on the... One just got me on the temple. I kind of smart to tell you the truth. Uh, okay, I'm going to let a little more smoke drift over them. My, my. I am going to put another brood chamber on top of this one. She, she, they're ready for it. Okay, don't. It's not likely she'd be on this one, but anything's possible. All right, I don't, uh, I don't share on this one. Now I'm going to go real fast back through the frames and just looking for her. She most likely will be where the, the where most of the bees are. This idea worked out uh, worked out real good uh, the way I did this, but you know I didn't know for sure until I clean this high body up. I've got to get that cardboard off the bottom of it. And uh, in say 16 days all of the brood down here will be hat will be hatched out and I'm planning on all that brood coming up here there's one exception if they start raising queen cells down there then all the bees won't come up here so now one other thing had that queen not been up here then I would I would cut a hole in the in the bottom of this trash can and smoke it heavy to chase her up here but didn't have to do that. So now I'm just gonna give them, let a little smoke drift across, across them, and I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, uh, lean this up to, to get to get the cardboard and there's 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 one more there's one more thing. Uh, Alright. Look here how they Look here how they, they ate. They ate all that cardboard. All that cardboard. They ate it away. They'll do that. Now, uh, when I put this high body back down on this queen excluder, I'm going to leave a little place right here so drones can, any drones that's in here, they can get out and they won't be trapped. So, uh, 
All right, we're set to go. I'm gonna put the inner cover back on there. One trying to get me on the lip. If they get you on the lip now, that that really stings. That'll smart. So I think I've told you everything. If you have any questions, let me know.